This is Twit. A box that's only about 14 inches deep, 48 inches tall, um, with no electronics in it. The electronics are outboard. That'll do 20 hertz to out to about 40 kilohertz and deliver. It's almost about 130 dB at a meter, which translates to 105 at 20, 25 feet. Well, you know, this brings up a question that I often pose to engineers anyway, uh, which is, why do you have to mix that loud? And I, I know you might not necessarily have the answer to it, but uh, they typically do. And so I think you're addressing the what they say they want, which is these very high SPLs. But as a hearing protection advocate myself, I'm concerned. And I've known engineers who have serious hearing loss because they mix so high. Uh, without getting too far off topic here, do you have any sense of, of why they need to mix that loud? Yeah. Actually, there, there are three things that we can say about that. Um, when we talk about 105 dB SPL, the average mixing level is 85, and that's 20 dB, dB of headroom over that. And typically, that headroom gets used for low-frequency content, uh, low frequency doesn't have the same impact on your ears. I mean, it will over long periods of time, but it's really the high frequencies that become painful at, at high volumes. So that gives the headroom that you need for things like explosions and effects and, and low frequency content. Um, the other thing is that if you have that kind of output capability, it means that the speaker's dynamic range capabilities are great. So even if you're chugging along at 75 or 80, you have that headroom to reproduce the transients, not just for a film, but for, for classical music, for instance. And of course, today's electronic production has a lot of dynamic range, assuming, assuming, and, and Scott, you and I talked about this, assuming that the mixer hasn't squashed the dynamic range <laughs> out of preference yes. or whatever. But um, yeah. we... So that 105 is kind of a, that's a, it's a guideline for film production, but it translates to 85 dB average with 20 dB of headroom. Turns mm. out that that headroom is very useful for classical and, and high dynamic range pop production. 